So, I'm here with Michael Alfretig, who of course is, you're the captain of the New York Athletic Club team. That's right. Originally from a place called Shreveport, Louisiana. He learned defense at Magnet High School under Sharon, Sharon Sellemeyer, exactly. who was a swimming champion, and she taught fencing. <laughs> now, tell us, how did fencing, how did you get to the point where you were going to be bigger in Shreveport? All right, well, what did, it? what did it was Junior Olympics. My first Junior Olympics was down in Florida, and I saw a thousand other kids. I'm like, this is a real sport. And I don't even think I made it past the first round my first JS, but I stayed and I watched all the way to the end. I saw the final eight, all these different colleges, and I'm like, one day, I want to be there. And about three years later, I was. And how did you end up at the AC? AC, a uh, great gentleman named George Mason. Uh, kind of saw me, and I kind of mentioned I was. Where did he see you? He saw me at one of the national championships, and I mentioned I might be going to NYU. And he mentioned New York Athletic Club, and I always saw the Athletic Club guys doing great. So I said, Well, if I want to be better, I have to be where the better people are. So I went to NYU, I went to New York Athletic Club. They were nice enough to let me in, coming from Shreveport. And a few days, oh, a few days, a few years later, well, actually, my first year, I started making finals in the juniors. And a couple years after that, finals in the seniors. So, Which great. coaches have had impact on you after Mac? After Mac? Coaches in New York or something. Yeah. So, um, Jerzy Grimsky was my first coach when I, when I first moved up to New York. And then Edward Elterman, who's primarily a, a foil coach, but he taught me at FA for three years. And then I uh, had Dr. Aldar Kogler for one year. And then for the longest period, it's a gentleman named Morris Lieberman, 95 to like 2003. 2001, and, th and since then I've been toying around with the lift lifelines. So all of them in each their own way, very important. Great coaches, great coaches. So what would you tell somebody about? The, what's the athletic club? What is the place now? What does it feel like to be that athletic club? Well, it's, a, it's an Olympic training center, and everyone that is part of the New York Athletic Club has a goal of either making the Olympics, or making a world team, or making a junior world team. And it's all about reaching our maximum potential. And so everybody works hard, but we all have a good time. And it's from you know, ages 14 to old guys like me who's 40. But I but I keep the kids in check. Yeah. We had uh, seven of the 24 people in the world team this year. Yeah. Michael Alfretique from Shreveport and the New York Athletic Club. Yeah. Thank you very much. Sure. Always.